The Sufis claim that Allah created the world for the sake of Muhammad sallallahu This is a very common practice among the average Muslim in the masjid in Saudi Arabia. That Allah created the dunya and the heavens and the earth for the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu And that this was written on the throne. And that, you know, the first thing Allah created was the light of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu And that he is the perfect man. Some of the Sufis say that the Prophet sallallahu has the attributes of Allah. Has the attributes of Allah. He is the perfect man and perfect divine being in one. So that to them, the Messenger of Allah is better than Allah. A'udhu Billah. And this is a very common belief among many people that have been influenced by the Sufis without even knowing. Without even knowing. They believe that the Prophet ﷺ, Allah created the dunya for his sake. And Allah says, وَمَا خَلَقْتُ الْجِنَّ وَالْإِنسَ إِلَّا لِيَعْبُدُونَ We were, Allah only created the, the everything, the jinn and the ins, and the dunya for them, so that they may worship him subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yes, the Prophet ﷺ is the best human being Allah ever created. We don't deny that. But Allah did not create the dunya for him. Allah told us why he created the dunya. On the other hand, he said to the Prophet ﷺ, وَعْبُدْ رَبَّكَ حَتَّى He created the dunya for him. Allah told us why he created the dunya. On the other hand, he said to the Prophet ﷺ, وَعْبُدْ رَبَّكَ حَتَّى يَأْتِيَكَ الْيَقِينَ And worship and enslave yourself to your master until death comes to you. That's what he was commanded sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. The Sufis claims that they can see Allah in the 